you now to business news. America's biggest retailer joins the vaccination effort. And who let the dogs out? Puppy love abounds for Valentine's Day. Then King Hall has the details in today's Money Watch report. The Dow sits at a record while the other two major averages hit cross currents yesterday. By the close, the Dow rose 61 points. The Nasdaq fell 35 and the S&P 500 shed a point. Walmart and Sam's Club stores are joining the vaccine race to fight the coronavirus. The big box chains will start administering COVID-19 vaccines tomorrow. The retailers will provide the service at more than 1,000 pharmacies in 22 states beginning this week. The company says it will focus attention on locations in underserved communities. Walmart hopes to be able to deliver nearly 13 million coronavirus vaccine doses every month. Ford is designing medical grade masks that will allow people who are hearing impaired to read lips. The automaker has developed a face mask with clear panels that it says filters most airborne particles. Right now, the mask is still in development and its filtration ability hasn't yet been approved by the federal government. And it's dogs over dudes for Valentine's Day. According to a new top data survey, 39% of unmarried dog moms would choose their pooch to spend the day with, while 23% of bachelors feel the same way. As for which states love their dogs the most, California and New York took the top spots, followed by Washington and Tennessee. And that's your CBS Money Watch report. For more, head to CBSMoneyWatch.com. At the CBS Broadcast Center, I'm Diane King-Hall.